Hello guys and welcome to my bed. <laughs> today's video I thought I would do a what's in my bag um I recently saw this video kind of going trending but maybe not just be it's probably because I just watched Kelsey Simone and she did this and I thought it was a really good idea so I am taking her idea <laughs> um but just know that I did get the idea from her it's also really good and I've been trying to buy that bag that she has in that video and this is it's sold out so this is the next closest thing I could find that I absolutely love it is from the brand and I saw it on Instagram all over so I figured might as well try it and I absolutely love it I don't know exactly how to pronounce it but it says it right there J W I call it pay J W pay P E I um, but I love it. The quality is amazing. It has the double strap where it could be a crossbody or an under the arm bag. Um, it's a great hard leather. Um, it's just amazing. I absolutely love it. But let's get started, shall we? <laughs> so, I that bag is very small, so I don't really carry that much. But what I do carry is, can you see? No, okay. I have still use my Gucci Marmont card holder. Um, it is my absolute favorite. I never really carry cash. So having this to just have all of my cards in is great. And I love how it's just black and sleek with the gold matches the bag, obviously. Moving on, my little Chanel palette essential which I still am too scared to use because I think it is just absolutely so pretty. But um, for traveling and on the go and say if you need to have a quick touch up, this thing is absolutely amazing. I don't think that they sell it anymore, honestly, because when I was buying it, the lady told me that this is actually the last one that they have and that they're discontinuing this specific color set. They have it in other colors. Um, but I thought this one was great because it's just a concealer, a highlighter, and a blush. And who doesn't need those things? You don't even have to worry about if it matches your skin tone because it basically is just your basic blush and highlight. Like, it doesn't really matter. So this for on the go is great. And especially for traveling, once we're able to do that again, I definitely will be taking this with me everywhere. And I like to keep it in the little sleeve that it comes in just so that if I drop it, it doesn't break. Um, <laughs> moving on, we have sunglasses. These are my favorite pair of sunglasses recently. These are just on Amazon. I got a pair of two for $12. It came as these black ones and also a brown tortoiseshell color. I think these are so great. Um, great quality, they fit great, they look great for $12 for two of them. Like, how could you go wrong? These are like the super trendy ones right now. So I like to just carry these around um, now that it's getting sunnier out. Moving on, we have my keys. Um, nothing special. I have a ton of stuff on here for absolutely no reason um, whatsoever. But, and it takes up a good portion of my bag, so I should probably take some things off because, um... It really takes up a lot of space but one of the things that I love on here whoops is at um, my high school project graduation they had um, people doing custom dog tags and my boyfriend Anthony as some of you might know him made me this cute little picture dog tag of us um, at prom it's one of my favorite pictures of us I think it is absolutely so cute so I have that on my chicken and then my mom made me this little macrame thing so that's that um it's gonna be a very short video because I really don't carry that much in my bag next I have one of these claw hair clips um, I got this from anthropology it came as a pack of three so I have this one again a tortoiseshell one and then a really pretty florally looking one as well and I like to have these because I just have a really bad habit of putting my hair up on a ponytail all the time and then my hair gets creases in it so I try to keep one of these around just in case I want to throw my hair back like that real quick um just because I just hate having my hair in my face sometimes so I like to be able to just 
get it out of my way without having it in a ponytail if I like just done it or something like that um, I like to carry these little clips around and this is a great size um, because it fits in my bag but it also holds my hair really well um, which I really really like because I have a lot of hair and it's really thick and it has these little grippy things in it so it holds my hair really well which I enjoy a lot because it's hard for me to find clips like that so if you have that problem anthropology has a whole bunch in a bunch of different colors as well so highly highly recommend um i also the last oh no i forgot i have a little it has this little mini front pocket which i love and that's where i carry my mask because it's the only thing that fits in that pocket and it's just this little <laughs> fake Chanel mask that I think is so cute. I literally bought it in the mall off one of those little kiosk stands. They had a whole bunch of like fake little um, designer brand ones. So I have this one, a Dior one. They had a Louis Vuitton one, Gucci, all that. Um, and it was cheap and it's, I really like it because I could just throw it in the wash and this is kind of the only mask that fits my face really well. Um, so I really like it and it's just blacks. So, and if I don't want the Chanel, I can just wear it on the inside like that. If like if I'm going to the gym, I just wear it like that um with the black on the outside and i always have this in my bag and i always have one in my car because i always forget to grab one so it's kind of nice to have that pocket because then i can carry my mask in it last but not least this spray hand sanitizer i usually carry this in my bag but right now it doesn't fit in this bag but i do have one in my car um if you hate the smell of regular hand sanitizer like me and you're I'm, I have a very sensitive smell just like my mom and that smell like the regular hand sanitizer smell makes me want to gag profusely I absolutely hate it it's just way too strong for me I, I literally can't take it anytime someone like when you walk into a store and they ask you to use it I always just pull out my own because it smells absolutely vile but these from Bath and Body Works is great their spray and they have the most amazing smells so so good this is the only time in my life that i've actually used hand sanitizer and enjoyed it because the smell of these still strong so i like kind of hold my breath and wave my hands around until it um dissipates a little bit but the smell is a lot a lot better um than your normal hand sanitizer this is the eucalyptus tea scent one this one is one of my favorites along with the cucumber melon one is also really really good um so if you're looking for a hand sanitizer that smells really nice um i recommend these oh my gosh i also totally forgot i keep my airpods in my bag all the time but i literally forgot them in my car because i was charging them oh my gosh and i'll i'll take a little clip of it because i have the cutest little floral case on it from urban outfitters that i love so much but i always have my airpods in my bag for when i go to the gym or if I'm in the car with not driving or something like that, I always also have my AirPods in my car. Uh, in my car? In my bag, in my purse. Okay, <laughs> moving on. Oh, there's also a, I have a random receipt for my nails. <laughs> um, in this little zipper, which I can barely fit anything in it as well, it's just a little chapstick. It's the Burt's Bees Vanilla Bean chapstick my lips get very very dry because i have a bad habit of biting them so i always carry this around me and especially with the changing in weather um my lips tend to get very dry so i always carry one of these on me as well um and it's my favorite chapstick i don't use anything else so now i think i've gone through everything also what i really enjoy about this bag really quickly is it has this great pocket like this big pocket in the back um it doesn't really like stretch i just got this bag so i really need to like wear it in a little bit but i think it's great because you can just put your phone back there and you have easy access to grab it which is nice if your hands are full you can just shove your phone right there um ooh. and i really enjoy that part about it because i never have pockets because they never make women's clothing with pockets because they want you to go and buy a purse so having that specific pocket is great because i don't have to like open it and try to like with one hand you know get my phone in there and it probably won't even fit because um i have all this other stuff in my bag so that is everything that i have in my bag um <laughs> I don't know if this was useful or helpful or if you guys enjoyed this, but if you did, 
um, give it a thumbs up to let me know that you did. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on the post notifications so that you guys know when I post. I am going, I'm putting it out into the universe that I'm going to try and be consistent and post once a week. Um, every week, not skipping any days, or sorry, any weeks, um, because I have been super bad at being consistent on this platform, and I want to try and get better at that. So, I'm not going to say a specific day that I'm going to post every week. I want to say it's going to be the weekends, most likely, just because, um, I have classes and stuff like that, so on the weekends is when I have the most time to be able to edit and upload as well. So I want to say that I'm going to be posting every weekend um, from here on out. And I'm also going to be trying to post more reels and IGTVs. So if you want to follow me on my Instagram for more fashion and lifestyle related content, it'll be down in the description below. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye guys.